This is the Fuzz Seeker from Donner. And this tiny little pedal right here is a loud, thick, and just plain nasty octave fuzz pedal that sounds pretty awesome on bass, and it's only $50 brand new. Hey y'all, Patrick here, and welcome to the first finds under 50 video in three, four, three, two, three years, I think. It's been a pretty long time to say the least, but I'm really excited to be able to talk about the Fuzz Seeker, this awesome little fuzz pedal as the first video back in the series. So the Fuzz Seeker, it's a cool blue, tiny little pedal. Seriously, this thing is uh, like two inches high, five inches wide, and literally an inch thick without counting for the foot switches. And it is really, really awesome and super loud too. It's an octave fuzz pedal that when I initially came across it, I thought it was for guitar only, but it is for bass too. And it sounds really good on bass in my opinion as well. It's something where you're able to get a lot of tone for not a lot of money, which of course I absolutely love. Before we really dig into this video and for the sake of transparency, I do want to say that Donner has provided me this cool little fuzz seeker and sponsored this video today, uh, but that has no effect at all on my opinions or my thoughts on this. So yeah, let's go. For your controls, you have four knobs, a two-way toggle switch, and two foot switches as well. For your knobs going from left to right, you start with your volume knob, which obviously affects the output, your tone knob, which is just a regular tone knob that you would find on any other pedal. Then for fluffy, this affects the amount of gain that you get. And it's actually pretty awesome because of course it can go all crazy and wild and nasty, but it's nice because you can dial it back and get some thick, but not just overly crazy fuzz sounds. Next to that, you have your two-way toggle switch that goes between two modes. On the top is scoop, then on the bottom is fat. Scoop is obviously where you have scooped mids, which I personally love, and then fat is your more thick, traditional sounding fuzz. Then next to that, you have the octave knob, which controls the amount of octave that you want in with your fuzz sound when it's engaged. And then for your foot switches, on the left is your regular on-off bypass, and then on the right is your octave on and off. So this is pretty much a very simple and straightforward layout that gives you exactly what you want. Fuzz, octave. If you want your octave on, turn it on. If you want it off, turn it off. And it's a lot of fun to experiment with the different tones you can get with this pedal, especially with that octave turned on. So overall for the Fuzz Seeker, this is just a plain awesome pedal to have for bass. It's an octave fuzz pedal that only costs 50 bucks, can get you some super thick tones. You can have fun with the octave on top of it. I wish there was a blend knob. That would just make it mm, mm, perfect. But it does have a blend knob, but you're not really gonna sacrifice a whole bunch without it though. As long as you keep your tone knob at noon or below, you'll be fine. If you go above noon, that's when you really start to lose some low end. But other than that, it's a thick and nasty octave fuzz pedal that sounds really good to me. But of course, let me know what you guys think about the Fuzz Seeker and what other $50 or below pedals I'm missing out on and I need to cover. Thank y'all so much for watching, as always, for watching, liking, subscribing, commenting, follow me on social media, you know, all that crazy stuff. And a humongous thank you to my Patreon supporters right over here. If you wanna be like one of these absolutely gorgeous people over here and help support the channel every single month and be included in things like early access to videos, giveaways, and more, then go ahead and check out my Patreon page. But y'all, thank you again so much for watching, as always. And of course, no matter where in the world you are, stay safe, practice that bass, turn on a fuzz pedal, go crazy, have some fun, and I'll see y'all next time. <laughs>